Hi, I'm Amy Shannon, and I'm going to interview author Amy Shannon. So, Amy, I would love for you to tell my audience about yourself. Oh, Amy, it is so good to be here. Thank you very much for having me on your show. It's so important. And I just wanted to say, buy my book. Please buy my book. If you don't like this one, I have more. Lots more. Really, I tell you, I have more books. Please buy them. Don't you realize that if you say, buy my book several million times, people are going to get tired of it. Well, I have a lot of books. So here's another one. This is supposed to be my last book that I wrote. But there may be more to come. I have my books on Barnes & Noble and Amazon and Goodreads and Kobo, and Paperback, and Kindle, and any other digital format you may want. But my audience wants to know more about you, and your writing, and what you do. Well, if you must know, I'm an editor I review books. I'm a literary consultant, so I like to help authors, you know, promote their books. But sometimes you really got to pick up a book of mine. And there you go. I have many more books listed on Amazon. So if there's not one you like, you might like them all. Well, not everybody wants to hear over and over again by your book. That may be true, but I am not talking just about one book. I have written over 130 books and stories and poetry. Surely somebody's want to read something. I wrote it. So people must read my book. They always said, if you write it, people will read it. Unfortunately, that is not true. People do not like you to shove your book in their face and tell them to buy it, no matter how many books you do or don't have. There are ways to market without shoving books down your family's throat saying, oh, look, I wrote another book. So please, don't be the buy me, Amy Shannon. Just be yourself and market your book. And if you read someone else's book, please write a review. Thank you. This has been Amy Shannon.